The Secretariat of State is the oldest dicastery in the Roman Curia, the central papal governing bureaucracy of the Catholic Church. It is headed by the Cardinal Secretary of State and performs all the political and diplomatic functions of the Holy See. The Secretariat is divided into three sections, the Section for General Affairs, the Section for Relations with States, and, since 2017, the Section for Diplomatic Staff. History of the Secretariat of State The origins of the Secretariat of State go back to the 15th century. The Apostolic Constitution non debit reprehensible of 31 December 1487 established the Secretaria Apostolica comprising 24 apostolic secretaries, one of whom bore the title Secretarius Domesticus and held a position of pre-eminence. One can also trace to this Secretaria Apostolica the Chancery of Briefs, the Secretariat of Briefs to Princes and the Secretariat of Latin Letters. Pope Leo X established another position, the Secretarius Intimus, to assist the cardinal who had control of the affairs of state and to attend to correspondence in languages other than Latin, chiefly with the apostolic nuncios who at that time were evolving into permanent diplomatic representatives. From these beginnings, the Secretariat of State developed, especially at the time of the Council of Trent. For a long time, the Secretarius Intimus, also called Secretarius Papi or Secretarius Maior, was almost always a prelate, often endowed with episcopal rank. It was only at the beginning of the pontificate of Innocent X that someone already a cardinal and not a member of the Pope's family was called to this high office. Pope Innocent XII definitively abolished the office of Cardinal Nephew, and the powers of that office were assigned to the Cardinal Secretary of State alone. On 19 July 1814, Pope Pius VII established the Sacred Congregation for the Extraordinary Ecclesiastical Affairs, expanding the Congregatio Super Negotiis Ecclesiasticis Regna Gallurum established by Pius VI in 1793. With the Apostolic Constitution Sapienti Concilio of 29 June 1908, St. Pius X divided the Sacred Congregation for Extraordinary Ecclesiastical Affairs in the form fixed by the Codex Iuris Canonici of 1917 can. 263, and he specified the duties of each of the three sections, the first was concerned essentially with extraordinary affairs, while the second attended to the ordinary affairs, and the third, until then an independent body the Chancery of Apostolic Briefs, had the the duty of preparing and dispatching pontifical briefs. With the Apostolic Constitution Regimini Ecclesia Universae of 15 August 1967, Pope Paul VI reformed the Roman Curia, implementing the desire expressed by the bishops in the Second Vatican Council. This gave a new face to the Secretariat of State, suppressing the Chancery of Apostolic Briefs, formerly the Third Section, and transforming the former First Section, the Sacred Congregation for the Extraordinary Ecclesiastical Affairs, into a body distinct from the Secretariat of State, though closely related to it, which was to be known as the Council for the Public Affairs of the Church. Structure on 28 June 1988, John Paul II promulgated the Apostolic Constitution Pastor Bonus, which introduced a reform of the Roman Curia and divided the Secretariat of State into two sections, the Section for General Affairs and the Section for Relations with States, which incorporated the Council for the Public Affairs of the Church. Pope Francis added a third unit, the Section for Diplomatic Staff. In November 2017, the head of the Secretariat of State is the Secretary of State, who is a cardinal. The Cardinal Secretary of State is primarily responsible for the diplomatic and political activity of the Holy See, in some circumstances representing the Pope himself. <laughs> Section for General Affairs the Section for General Affairs handles the normal operations of the Church including organizing the activities of the Roman Curia, making appointments to curial offices, publishing official communications, papal documents, handling the concerns of embassies to the Holy See, and keeping the papal seal and fisherman's ring. Abroad, the Section for General Affairs is responsible for organizing the activities of nuncios around the world in their activities concerning the local Church. Substitute for General Affairs 
The section for general affairs is headed by an archbishop known as the Substitute for General Affairs, or more formally, Substitute for General Affairs to the Secretary of State. The current Substitute for General Affairs to the Secretary of State is Archbishop Edgar Peña Para. There have been ten substitutes since 1953. Nicola Canali, the 21st of March 1908 to the 24th of September 1914. Federico Tedeschini, the 24th of September 1914 to the 31st of March 1921. Giovanni Battista Montini, the 13th of December 1937 to the 17th of February 1953. Later Pope Paul VI. Angelo Dell'Acqua, the 17th of February 1953 to the 29th of June 1967. Giovanni Benelli, the 29th of June 1967 to the 3rd of June 1977. Giuseppe Caprio, the 14th of June 1977 to the 28th of April 1979. Eduardo Martinez Samalo, the 5th of May 1979 to the 23rd of March 1988. Edward Idris Cassidy, the 23rd of March 1988 to the 12th of December 1989. Giovanni Battista Re, the 12th of December 1989 to the 16th of September 2000. Leonardo Sandri, the 16th of September 2000 to the 1st of July 2007. Fernando Filoni, the 1st of July 2007 to the 10th of May 2011. Giovanni Angelo Bescia, the 10th of May 2011 to the 29th of June 2018. Edgar Peña Para, the 15th of October 2018 present. Topic: Assessor for General Affairs of the Secretariat of State. Topic: The deputy to the Substitute for General Affairs, effectively Deputy Chief of Staff, is called the Assessor for General Affairs of the Secretariat of State. The current Assessor for General Affairs of the Secretariat of State is Monsignor Paolo Borgia. Eduardo Martinez Samalo, 1970-11 December 1975. Giovanni Battista Re, the 12th of January 1979 to the 9th of October 1987. Crescenzio Seat, the 10th of October 1987 to the 2nd of February 1992. Leonardo Sandri, the 4th of February 1992 to the 22nd of July 1997. James Michael Harvey, the 22nd of July 1997 to the 7th of February 1998. Pedro Lopez Quintana, the 7th of February 1998 to the 12th of December 2002. Gabriele Giordano Caccia, the 17th of December 2002 to the 16th of July 2009. Peter Brian Wells, the 16th of July 2009 to the 9th of February 2016. Paolo Borgia, the 4th of March 2016 present. Topic. Section for relations with states. Topic. Topic. Origin Topic. The Congregation for the Ecclesiastical Affairs of the Kingdom of France was set up by Pope Pius VI with the Constitution Solicitudo Omnium Ecclesiarum in 1793 to deal with the problems created for the Church by the French Revolution. In 1814, Pope Pius VII gave this office responsibility for negotiations with all governments, renaming it the Extraordinary Congregation for the Ecclesiastical Affairs of the Catholic World Latin, Congregatio Extraordinaria Prepacita Negotiis Ecclesiasticis Orbis Catholici. Some years later, Pope Leo XII changed its name to the Sacred Congregation for Extraordinary Ecclesiastical Affairs Latin, Sacra Congregatio Pro Negotiis Ecclesiasticis Extraordinaries, which remained its title until 1967 when Pope Paul VI separated this body from the Secretariat of State, calling it the Council for the Public Affairs of the Church. This council was later replaced by the present section for relations with states. Responsibilities Topic. The section is responsible for the Holy See's interactions with civil governments. According to the relevant articles of the Apostolic Constitution Pastor Bonus, the responsibilities of the Secretary for Relations with States are 
For the Holy See's diplomatic relations with states, including the establishment of concordats or similar agreements. For the Holy See's presence in international organizations and conferences such as the United Nations. In special circumstances, by order of the Supreme Pontiff and in consultation with the competent dicasteries of the Curia, provides for appointments to particular churches, and for their establishment or modification. In close collaboration with the Congregation for Bishops, it attends to the appointment of bishops in countries which have entered into treaties or agreements with the Holy See in accordance with the norms of international law. Topic. Structure Topic. The section is headed by an archbishop, the Secretary for Relations with States, who reports to the Secretary of State. His staff includes a prelate, the Undersecretary for Relations with States, and is assisted by cardinals and bishops. The Secretary for Relations with States is often called the Foreign Minister of the Holy See, and the Undersecretary is often called the Deputy Foreign Minister. The current Secretary for Relations with States is Archbishop Paul Gallagher. The current Undersecretary for Relations with States is Monsignor Antoine Camilleri. The current delegate for pontifical representations is Archbishop Jan Pawlowski and the current head of protocol is Monsignor José Avellino Betancourt. <laughs> Section for diplomatic staff on 21 November 2017, via a communique of the Secretariat of State, it was announced that Pope Francis had created the Section for Diplomatic Staff, expanding the responsibilities of the Delegate for Pontifical Representations. Reportedly, it started operating on 9 November 2017. Since its creation it has been headed by Archbishop Jan Romeo Pawlowski. See also Topic. Latin Letters Office Index of Vatican City-related articles Topic. References Topic. Topic. External links Topic. Secretariat of State by gcatholic.org Profile of the Secretariat from Vatican. V.A. The Pope's Team, The Vatican's Secretariat of State from Catholic Culture.